So here we are arriving in Africa. Um, even though the tanker gave us the coordinates of the harbor as we approached, we saw that there were a lot of breaking waves fairly far off the shore. And so we weren't quite sure of the depths. And we end up hailing down. You see the little fishing boat there. And they, uh, they were very gracious. We bartered a... They gave us a fish and guidance into the port, and we gave them a bottle of wine and brought us into the port in El Jadida. We're the only non-fishing vessel there. We later took that fish and the leftover fruit that we had bought in Madeira and used it to pay our guardian that watched over the boat uh, while we were um, running around Morocco. And a couple of his friends coming down to check out the boat. <laughs> I didn't quite know what to make of it. So now uh, we'll put this in the audio commentary at the end. Probably don't have time to pack it in, but uh, it's a story in and of itself. Uh, what happened to you in Morocco? Yeah. I think, uh, needless to say, you're lucky you're not still in jail there. Right? <laughs> in Moroccan jail. Yeah. There's the the f fishing boat and the fish that we got. This is the boardwalk in Al Jadida. And road signs on the way to Marrakesh. This is where we went off-roading. We took a little Ford Escort through that terrain. There's a film festival going on in Morocco. This is a Berber antique store that we did a lot of business at. That was our guardian. Refueling. We have proof that I can grow facial hair. Mm-hmm. <laughs>